Hi, this is Hilly Zavaro. Today I will show you how to start a Flipgrid for your classroom without the use of email addresses or if you just want to simplify the process for your students. So you first want to log in to your educator account. Once you're in, you want to start a grid, add new grid. You want to give it a name, for example, food around the world. And then student ID, you want to click on student ID. Then here, you want to change it to a catchy name, for example, test grid one, two, one, two, three. Or you should probably put your name here, for example, Zavaro123. And then next. Then once you're in, you want to give a name. But the name should be something general. Let's say grade 6. And then the student ID would be 1, 2. Something very, very simple. And then you click next. And then launch my grid and then you have this address. This is the address you need to give to your student, flipgrid.com slash zavaro123 or whatever name you had on there. Let me show you what it looks like when students log in. So students go to flipgrid.com slash zavaro123 or whatever address you decided and then they see this food around the world they add their code. The code was 1, 2. That was very, very simple. You keep something very simple. 1, 2. And then let's go. Then they are in and they can just upload their videos. For example, Hi, this is my video. So to start, we click here. Hello, this is my video. So once students are done, they click here and next this arrow and then a selfie and of course to the selfie they can add emojis anything they like and once they're done they click on the arrow and then it saves it and then here you can see the display name is grade 6. Here you need to tell your students to change this and put their real name or their first name. They can add a title or a link. They don't have to, but that's just about it. Submit my video and then they're on the grid. You see, I didn't need to submit any email address uh, or anything at all. So I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and have fun. Bye.